There we go. I included me out here. <sighs> but if I were you, I would, uh, you know, just lay off the texting. <laughs> what? <laughs> she fucking blocked me. <laughs> she probably blocked me too. Oh, okay. Uh, enough about that. We're having a, <laughs> a fucking laugh at the fucking random stackedness of the deck here against this. We can't have fun Staying with this because it's just fucked up. All of the fucking times we've been here, somehow. Yeah. I'm not even attempting to win. Yeah, we're just both playing fucking blind, basically. I mean, I'll peek at my cards and see what the fuck is going on, but I, we're just Dude, fucking, I'm not peeking at my cards, that's what's sad about we're this. We're just going back and forth, letting the game play itself at this point. Thanks for telling her to stop bugging me, though. That helped me out immensely. Yeah. I was like, just gonna keep fucking with her. You know that. That's why I didn't say anything. <laughs> Dude, this card game is a hell of a lot better than that shit. You know? And we're getting a fucking laugh out of this card game. Somehow or another, I just might win this one, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got three sixes. Say tag. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's something else when you. You know, a thought just occurred to me. I'm gonna say it anyway. Satan masquerades as a black man so he can see the seediest underside of that humanity has to offer in order to determine just how fucking pathetic humans really are. <laughs> and I'm just sitting there having a fucking card game with him. <laughs> Black man with a pro. I'm losing Jared money girl. in it, and we're basically just letting the cards play themselves, but, you know, that's how and it is. Like, somehow winning in the fact of the matter, I'm not even paying attention. In fact, I was rolling a joint. <laughs> uh, that, that, that's, you know, wow. That anyway. tells you how much I'm not paying attention. <laughs> Oh, yeah, you know, fuck it. I told her I could... Well, I was gonna tell her. I can fuck a billion used condom whores. So fuck off. Yeah. Yeah, and I can go on I any heard. fucking website and just fucking start chatting with any fucking used condom slut. Or some actual decent person. Some actual fucking decent person who gives a fuck. Mm -hmm. And start a relationship. But this person's just fucking trash. Yeah. Only reason I was gonna keep her was just to keep fucking with her. That's what I was doing the whole time. After she told me what she told me yesterday, that's when I was like, okay, I'm just gonna send this whole message to blog to him. Even though I'm gonna tell him straight up all it says is or Yeah, or, and her defense or. was it's a joke. I told her fucking long ass fucking time ago. I've told her repeatedly. If you keep saying dumb shit, it's not a fucking joke when you say that you're dead fucking serious and you're not joking. You keep lying like this and you're gonna lose what little friends you've got left. And now she and has. She, she said, How many friends am I gonna lose? I said, Probably. Every all last of fucking one of them. Because you're just you're a dumb bitch being... who doesn't give a yeah, fuck okay. about being a nice person to everyone else around you. You don't give a fuck about and being a fine. decent person at all. And or being honest, with that matter. Just in, yeah, just she's just too much of a fucking lying bitch. I'm just... How the fuck? What? You got three kings. I hey, know, but give me back those that? wise men. They don't belong to you, Satan. I'm going Dude, to eat no. them. 
They're no beast joke, jerky. Right? What are the odds that I've won every single fucking round so far? What are the odds of that? And I'm not even trying. <coughs> Imagine they're pretty fucking... Play themselves. <laughs> they're favoring you for no reasons. We're not paying them any reasons not... at all, and they're just like, oh, right, fuck it, we're giving the shit to this guy. I'm not... I'm legitimately not looking at my cards, dude. I don't know what the hell they are. Is this so some I'm sort of Call begging. of Duty bullshit host server privileges? Is that what's going on here? <laughs> Let's hope not. That I really good. do hope not. Because that would take the fucking piss. Yeah, you seem a lot happier now that she's gone, though, you see? No, I'm just happy we can fucking play games together again. And we're having fun with it. This, yeah, this well, other bitch, you know. Nightmare. Hey, to you it's a nightmare. To me, it's it's just my body telling me it was too fucking hot. No, 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 not that. That, besides that, I'm saying what happened yesterday with the game situation, that was a nightmare. Oh, yeah, yeah. I guess I was right in telling you to hold off until, you know, things get fixed. Yeah, I should have listened, but look, okay? I know, you All were right. excited to play poker. We'd been waiting for it for fucking months. Yeah, I was way too excited, so waiting was like, dude, I've been waiting. Don't tell me to wait anymore. I've been. You got a five high straight? A pair of aces. Dude, this is literally the sixth time I won. Are you fucking kidding me? You got two, three, and four in suit. That's why it gave it to you. I was, <coughs> I was legitimately smoking a joint. I'm not uh... kidding. Man, these cards are just playing themselves, you know? It, pretty soon, they I'm are. not going to have $5 anymore. I, I'm going to have... Well... I, I, you know, a few hands ago I had tree fifty, but now I got two thirty two. <laughs> I'm just gonna go forty four. Fuck it, dude. It's working. That's what's good. I'm happy about it. I, I was waiting. Okay, I was being sort of patient. Sorta. Of. You mean as patient as what? I was? Dude, I was patient for for seven years waiting for this damn game. And I had to wait for a couple, literally almost another year for them to add poker. You know what, fuck it. I hope this humiliates the bitch. Katie fucking Miles is a big fucking whore. And a lying bitch who doesn't give a fuck about her friends. Fuck her. She's just a stupid piece of shit. And if you think it's right to lie and cheat people, you are a piece of shit too. Because that is not right. You should never lie and or cheat anyone. Because it's retarded, for one. And this should be a thing. She's like that fucking stream sniper, Vitable, but in real life. She just doesn't give a fuck about anyone. Yeah. So fucking bad. She sent, she sent me fucking pictures of fucking supermodels saying she's gonna marry this person. She's dead fucking serious. And it's not a joke. And I keep telling her, okay, you've had your giggle. Fucking stop now. It's not funny anymore. And she just she keeps on fucking one. going. She, she went for fucking 30 minutes straight bitching about that. She doesn't even know any supermodels, that's the thing. I know. It was just all a lie. She's just a dumb fat cunt who wants fucking attention and she doesn't care who she hurts. There's no fucking way I won again. And I hope she fucking sees this video when it goes up. Dude, how the fuck did I win again? Let's stop talking about her and play the game because I'm more <laughs> interested in how the fuck I keep winning. Nah, I know what it is. It's it's the fucking cards. They're just playing you out. 
<laughs> like, we're yeah. not we're not trying to bluff each other or anything. We're not trying to do any of the uh, any of the poker 101 shit. We're just letting the cards run out, and every time the cards are favoring you for no fucking reasons. Yeah, I, I'm not even paying attention. I was again just smoking much of one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> If I were trying, uh, I'm sure you would know it. Mm -hmm. <coughs> oh, boy. I really don't think that they put in a, a decent shuffling algorithm. Doesn't seem like it. It's okay, though. I'm sure it'll fix it. Yeah. On the offline. After we've had a lot of fun, and then it becomes boring when it's evened out. <laughs> well, it'll seem boring, because we're having so much fun laughing at this shit right now. Because this is ridiculous. I've won literally seven times without yeah, fail. And I'm not it is even ridiculous. I don't even want to win. That's what's sad. <laughs> Mean review. Ow. Ow. Out of fucking money, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Again, I'm not really seeing the odds in this, but... there, So far, there are no odds. It's favored you every fucking time. Oh yeah, I've got 70 Ow. cents left. I've won nine times so far. In a row. In a row, without fail. Oh, yeah. I want to point out to everyone, this is what real friends do, you know? We just sit here and let the fucking card game play itself out and laugh at it. This is what real yeah. friends is about. Not being we're having stupid fun together. We're not fucking lying. <laughs> and bragging about dumb shit. Yeah, we're not going off and bragging about having sex with girls. You know, we're not going off and bragging about how much better our lives are than each other. Exactly. As I explained to her, though, by the way, because when she said that, I was just like, yeah, all right, cool. What do you want from me? And then she's like, well, I thought you were going to say more. I'm like, well, if it's any consolation to you, it'd be the same thing if I were saying, hey, I'm about to go fuck some bitch. It's disrespectful. And I'm tired of it from her. I'm just fucking tired of it. It's not a it's real sick. friend. Why is that all the same fucking suit? Do you see those cards? <laughs> Queen, three, six, four, all diamonds. And Wait, and you'll see if it's gonna be another diamond. <laughs> be funny I've got a diamond in my hand. I've I've got a nine of diamonds and a six of hearts. So you want to see something really funny? You're gonna be like, why? How? And then you'll see why you're I keep gonna win how. this one too. What? This does no. There's no way. Look at that. that Look at that the is, hand. That is not fuck. That is not fucking shuffled, mate. What the hell? This is beautiful. This is actually beautiful. This is literally... I'm just going to make you go all in, because why the fuck not? There you go, dude. Let's just get it over with. <sighs> fucking cards, man. Okay. Shuffle yourselves. That's why I said that. There you go. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for giving me some of the money the cards stole from me back. Because <laughs> you didn't do shit. The cards were just like, fuck you. I, I legitimately didn't do anything. I was just like, what? I'm not attempting to win. Oh yeah, another thing. A real friend isn't going to go to your other friend when, you've un when you haven't blocked them. And they're not going to go off to your friends 
and brag about shit like how they're doing shit behind your back when they fucking made promises. And this fucking bitch did make fucking promises. I shit you not, mate. Yeah, friends don't go off and brag behind your back to your other friends and tell them that they're doing shit. Exactly. And they most certainly don't push you to the point where you fucking block them and then go whine to your friends telling them to fucking unblock you. It's fucking childish bullshit. That's just fucking drama for the fuck's sake of attention. And, you know, yesterday, Joe, I was watching um, Brighter Side talking about signs of fake friends and real friends. Fake people and real people. Yeah. This fucking bitch ticks every goddamn box on the list for a fake ass person. Yeah. That's why every I was warning you about one it. Of them. That's why I was warning you about it. I don't need to watch no YouTube channel called Brightside or whatever. No, I, I just wanted to see I... what what they saw as being a fake person. I'm sure they know. It, it is pretty obvious when you when you think about it. It really is. Yeah, it's pretty fucking obvious. They go behind your back and do dumb shit. They brag about the stupidest things. They lie. That's just some they, of the fucking big stuff. They send you a message saying the stupidest shit ever, like, I cut myself. No, no, you mate. I legitimately went up and, died the, up and down the entire left side of my body once. And I'm not saying this to fucking brag. Don't fucking think of it that way, everyone who may be watching. I have cut myself before. Because I was in a fuck ton of pain. And I didn't have any pain relievers at all. Three sevens. Okay. Yeah. Um, well, she just messaged me saying I cut myself. She's just fucking whining for attention. Tell her to send me a fucking picture and unblock me like she whined to you about. <laughs> At this point, we're just fucking with her. She's just pushed so fucking far on both of us that we don't care anymore and we're just fucking with her. So let's just push it as far as we can. Unless it is just too much for you. In that case, you know, just block her and we'll be fucking done with it. I don't want to fuck with her anymore. And I'm not even... Literally, I just said, okay, I, I don't, that's a really ridiculously dumb thing to do. Um, there, you had literally no reasoning. You were being dumb and lying. That's not what you're supposed to do. When you lie, expect people to just turn against you because they find out and they're sick of your lying. You know, especially when it's so fucking obvious that you, you fucking make up this horrendous fucking lie and keep saying, I'm dead serious, I'm not lying. And then, you know, after someone says, alright, fuck off, and then you come back and say, it's a fucking joke. You don't have a sense of humor. What the fuck? It's not a joke. It's just straight up fucking being a bitch. What's even stupider? She told me I don't have a sense of humor. I'm probably like the most funniest person she knew. Quite literally. Dude, you you so fucking funny. You made me laugh so hard that my heart stopped beating for a moment and I had to restart it. <laughs> that was fucking hilarious even at the time. You know, even though I couldn't laugh at it. Because I had to restart my heart. That was fucking hilarious. So if I don't know hilarity, there's oh, something going oh, on. Oh, hold up, hold up. If I'm, if I don't have a sense of humor, how the fuck did I make a man with Asperger's laugh? And a man how the fuck did I do that without a sense of humor? You tell me. Also make a man who rarely laughs at anything. <clears throat> Me, yeah, laughing. I've, I've managed to get a couple of giggles out of you. I'm rather uh, proud of that accomplishment. But I 
am the only one I know who can claim that he has made a man with Asperger's laugh. Legitimately. I tell you, I'm gonna tell you something. His gamer tag used to be Black Jaguar. You remember him? Yeah, he's a nice, he's a nice champ. Um, dude, I just got a message again saying I'm just an emotional punching bag. <laughs> Tell her, it doesn't sound like she tell her to unblock <laughs> me like she whined to you about. <laughs> I did. I told her. I'm just an emotional punching bag. I said, okay. That only makes me laugh. But I like to see people in pain. Yeah. Hey, everybody. This is a fucking lesson. When you push people as far as this bitch has, then you become their emotional punching bag when they get sick of your shit. Oh, yeah. At this Pushing point, we just don't fucking point. care about her anymore, and we are using her as an emotional fucking punching bag. Yeah. <laughs> She's been such Having a dumb a... fucking bitch. Lying and hurting people is not what you're supposed to do. Yeah. And, and it's every fucking make... time. Every fucking yeah, time this make... bitch lies. Like, showing the person what they're doing, and they're obviously not listening. And that's the first thing that they're doing wrong. You're not listening. And if you have someone in your life, don't say anything here, Kadani. This is just going to help people. If you have someone, someone in your life that is doing this, and they're literally making you their emotional punching bag, because they're going to you and they're punching at you and punching at your strings to make you think that they're in bad shape or something, you need to notice it right off the bat. You really do, because they're going to just keep doing this until they progress to a point where you're just going to get mad at them. So yeah. don't let that happen. Uh, Joe, unfortunately, a lot of kids' parents do this to them because their parents view their children as property to be owned and commanded. I've seen this way yeah. too many times, and I'm tired of yeah. seeing it. I've seen that as well, and it shouldn't be a thing either. Your parents, you should not let your parents do that, and if anyone's listening to this and your parents are doing that, Try to get a hold of someone that can help you, for all. Because that should not be happening. Yeah, and most of the time what I see is the emotional and psychological abuse. Kids, it is illegal. You can go to the cops. If it's that bad to where your parents make you cry every time they talk to you, and you find yourself actively going out of your way to avoid your parents... That's the fucking warning signs right there that something needs to fucking change. Yeah, if you're attempting to hurt yourself and shit behind your parents' back because you're afraid of them. If you're so don't stressed be afraid out of that, yeah, you just need to go and talk to the police. That's the fucking job to serve and protect the public trust. Not the trust fund, which they do now, but the trust of the public in them. That's their fucking job. Yeah, thanks you for go. reminding me. I just got carried away. <laughs> fucking yeah, public no, service we're... announcements for the win. Yeah, we're only we're only saying this because we've seen this shit happen, and we see it happen to a lot of people. And, and for I me, I I lived I... through it. Yeah, and I, and I attempt to help people with it. I really do. It doesn't happen to me because I, I just don't let it. What the fuck is these cards, mate? Dude, I don't know. These shuffles are strange. I haven't seen shuffling like this actually ever, in fact. This is some sort of fucking James Bond bet it all and win hard movie-esque bullshit suffling. That's what this is. Suffling? <laughs> suffling, shuffling. Fucking, I'm having difficulty with words today. Three, two, one. There you go, buddy. <laughs> Oh, thanks. 
think we're gonna let you leave out of here with no money. It'd be ridiculous. Also, if anyone did want to play alongside us, you can, but we have to make sure that you're not going to be a troll. No, mate. I'm fucking done letting random people in all together. Okay, well. No fucking apologies. I'm tired of the fucking trolls and cunts. As am I. I'm done with it. Ow. Fucking liars, trolls, cunts, stream snipers, bitches, hoes, whatever you want to call them. Just genuinely fucking bitch people, fake ass whores, have pushed us so far, well, me, that I'm just, I'm not letting any more random people in. I'm done with it completely. Me, I don't really let them push me, saying that. I just don't care. <laughs> I usually it, just as far as saying they've pushed me, I'm just so bored of it. I'm bored of the fucking idiots who play this game like Call of Duty, and all they want to do is just kill you just because they fucking can. I'm bored. Yeah, they, they're, I'm I've, bored I've gone of, past anger they, to the point of being bored of it. I'm, I'm too, I was already to the point of boredom with people doing this in reality. And they do it a lot. They act like reality is a game. Reality is no fucking and, game. Yeah, reality is not a game. And it should never be treated as such. Yeah, Bobby fucking Kotick. Reality's not a game where you can acquire the most money. The people who work developing games are not bodies, bitches. Yeah, that was specifically meant for people like Bobby Kotick. Fuck those assholes. Those are the fucking kinds of bitches we're tired of dealing with. I mean, I'm just tired of dealing with people in general, but... After dealing with a few hundred million people? Yeah, I can see your point. You're just tired of dealing with people altogether. Which is why I tend to just talk to a few people. Glad I'm one of them. I really am. Uh. Hold up. Queen and an ace in the exact same suit. Something tells me the cards are not going to support this royal flush. Is that what you think, huh? Well, thank you again. We're about to find out. And no, they're not. <laughs> oh, really? That's what you think, huh? Oh, yeah, I've got two aces with a kick queen kicker. I know, I know the bare my... bones minimum basics of this game. <laughs> I mean, I taught you, like, the shit I know. In a moment, you're gonna see something really crazy happen. <sighs> Saying that, I don't really suppose that I'm gonna win. I wouldn't think that I would. I have the worst. Uh, yeah, no, you're you're definitely gonna win. You should. Yeah, anyway. with those double aces, know. queen kicker. I'm just checking every damn thing. Fuck it, you know. All right. Is that the second time in a row that I've won? Third. Second, third, okay. This, th these cards, they're, they're fucking playing us back and forth, you know? It's not letting either of us actually win. If they went in favor of balance... Uh, the, I've seen... I, that's why I'm just going along with it, dude. The I've way seen is... How. The way it's going back and forth, you win a few, then I win a few. The way it's going back and forth is just... It's weird. It's yeah, I know, it's screwy. Uh, what do I have? Um, I, have I, a... I was noticing 
I was noticing how it is, and I just kind of went along with it. Hmm. I have That's a jack just... and a three. I know. If I'm gonna call, yeah, why not? Well... <coughs> oh, excuse me. A dollar is the max bet? Nice to know that. That's why I did it like that, dude. I know. <laughs> Two jacks. <laughs> okay. I know how this game is going to play out. That's why I just did this. Now you're literally earning the money you just lost from me. Okay, 40 more cents, and then I'll have tree 50. Well, we both started out with five. How do you have 596? Uh, taxes? This game taxes you? Yes. That's bullshit. I mean, you have... Eh, fuck it. Two dollars. Wanna know who's gonna win? No, just taxes in general are bullshit. I've explained oh, yeah, this in a previous video. Taxes are bullshit. Oh, gee, we're gonna win again? Of course I no. was. We see the pattern. I've got one more win, then it's gonna switch off. <laughs> they didn't make it to where it fucking balances correctly. That's actually fucking hilarious. That's At least we're way. having a giggle out of it. At least you're having a giggle. Yeah, but it is, it is, you gotta admit, it is ridiculously hilarious because... Oh yeah, uh, hey, I've gotta do this just for shits and tits. Hey viewers, I'm out of Dr. Pepper. Support me on Patreon so I can sa satiate my Dr. Pepper addiction. Mine too! Not on his, on my Patreon. Here's my Patreon, I don't have one. How are they gonna support you on your Patreon when it doesn't exist? i tell you what, mate. I'll, I'll use mine to send you some money as well when when I actually get people to support me and that's literally what they'll be doing you, you hear me everybody you will literally be supporting me it's not the channel it's not me producing better content you'll just be giving me money which so, is, which yeah. is what if you enjoy throwing on. away your money to people like Bobby Kodak and getting shit for it and paying egregious amounts on microtransactions Throw away your money to me. I'll actually use it to get food. And, you know, Joe will just go off and get drugs with it because he's in a country now that lets him do that. How is it in that unnamed country that doesn't exist on any map anywhere? <laughs> and there are actually islands like that, too. So people are going to be like going, oh, well, which island is it? I'll tell you, mate, you're not going to fucking find it. And if you do, you're going to see men in black suits outside your bedroom window while you sleep with porn stashes. You legit just, funny enough, you legit just can't find it on, on the fucking thing. I can because you allowed me to by telling me exactly where it fucking is. But no one else can. What's even funnier, though, is even when you looked it up, and it's not like it showed there was houses or anything. There was a few little shops, but there wasn't really houses. There are houses. I was just, uh, you know, I was just looking stuff up to see what was close to you. Because you were wondering, because you hadn't seen one. And it was, uh, it was well known in that area. For the brand name that it was. Strangely enough, I just haven't seen one. No, it was just weird to me. Well, that's because the the closest one was so fucking far away on another fucking island. Okay, yeah, now that makes sense. And that's what I said. It does make sense. Tell me something, man. Do you have coconuts on those islands? 
as every movie no. island does. <laughs> no, that's uh, that's not on every island, unfortunately. There, are, there probably are some coconuts somewhere, but I haven't, I haven't really seen any. I mean, except if I could go to one of the shops, you could straight up buy them. Oh, they're imported. No, yeah, they're no, imported no, they over here too. No, no, they, my they, cards. I know it's gonna make you win this round. <laughs> That's why I told you. At this point, it legitimately is just for fun. <laughs> I think that's how they made it. If you're actually playing with a friend, they wanted to make it fun. Dude, you just wanted the poker in the game just for the fun of it anyway. And this is yeah. exactly what people did in the West. They did you know? it for fun. They didn't they, have They just else played to do. for fun. All those card sharks you see in the movies with fucking aces up their sleeves. When that did happen, it was in the cities, in the east also, part of the United also, States. Yeah, also when it did happen, unfortunately, what would happen then is they would be killed. Yeah, they'd take out the gun and blow their fucking heads off right there at the table and continue playing the game like nothing ever happened. Because uh, it's not allowed. You're not supposed to be cheating like that. Ever. Especially in cars. People call the thing I do cheating, but card counting is not cheating. If anything, mm. it's just being intelligent. Yeah, but anyway, that, that card nonsense with the ace up the sleeve, that only happened in the big cities in the eastern part of the United States. That didn't happen out west. People out west yeah, were yeah. far too busy. They were far too busy, you know, prospecting, doing the fucking chores, milking cows and shit. They were far too fucking busy for that bullshit. They had families yeah. to take care of. They had to fend off nice. wild animal attacks, you know, while they were hunting. What's nice about this, though, is that that's not, that can't be a thing in this game. It wouldn't even make sense, I don't think. Nah, it wouldn't. It, it really, really wouldn't. Maybe in a larger city with taller buildings, it would make sense, but not in Texas, which is where it's set. Fuck no. I mean, it happened out in in the oceans as well. There was there was pokers out in the ocean. In fact, that was a thing. It just wasn't. All the time. It was for events. It was literally like if someone famous came to that side of the world. <clears throat> and what's even weirder is they wouldn't even do it half time then. But if they did it then, it was just because they wanted more money. Yeah, because they were greedy. And people like and that is exactly what Bobby Kotick and other bastards and bitches in the fucking corporate level America are greedy fucking bitches so give me your money everybody I'll buy food with it and, and then I'll send and some to Joe said, and he'll go buy fucking drugs with it there's no drugs that I buy oh yeah sorry mate it's a plant it's a naturally occurring substance it's not a drug if I were buying drugs, that'd be a little more different, but I'm not. There's no drugs that I buy. Oh yeah, I actually need to go and get some antidepressant medication. Me and Jim Sterling have that in common. And yeah, it clearly fucking blatantly and painfully shows in some of my videos how fucking depressed I get. Yeah, there's no need for depression. Jim That's Sterling's right, for. mate. If you think that you don't need fucking drugs to fix that shit or, you know, alleviate the symptoms, you're dead fucking wrong. Well, I don't. I All I need is weed, and it's helped me all my life. I mean, anything. Yeah, well, here's the thing, mate. You know, you... you some of you family members, you know, haven't tried to actively go out of the way to abuse, mistreat, and, you know, actually try to fucking kill you. Most of mine uh, yeah. have. Yeah, but here's the thing, though. I haven't let them, either. 
I had moved away from them. You forget this. Yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, I guess I'm a little more intelligent saying I just was like, hey, fuck you guys. Mate, this is back when I was so young. And, you know, I didn't know how to deal with the fucking stress. And I was just flipping the fuck do. out all the time. And I tried to explain to you what to do, but you didn't want to listen. No, this is before I fucking met you, mate. I'm saying, like, you know what I mean. When you were you were like that too when we first met. So that's the thing. I yeah. was attempting to help you. I'm still fucked Best in the way. head, but not as violently and horrifically as I used to be. As I said. You're going to have to start smoking weed, mate. Here's the I best know thing. I need to. This is a wondrous thing. If aliens are doing it. <laughs> mate, I can point to a so-called alien, as these humans put it. Me? And no matter which one I point to, they're all going to be fucking doing it. Hell, even the demons. Even they do it. They've got their own brand. Even Satan, he's doing it right now. Yes, you are. And I don't give a fuck who knows this shit anymore. I'm just fucking blown away, you know? You and I, well, I don't know about you, but I've been on this planet for 80 fucking million years. I'm tired of this pattern repeating itself. I've the rise and fall of human civilizations. I'm tired of the pattern. It's boring. I've been here for a bit. I've been seeing a lot of the shit going down, and I even warned you of some shit that was going to happen. Yeah, and, and a lot of it's already happened. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. speaking of, um, the leaves on the trees are drooping even more, and it is too hot for this time of year. It is way too fucking hot. Over here, I'm on an island. It's not supposed to be hot. Like, I mean, I get it. I'm near the equator in Alabama, the left testicle of the United States. I get it. It's supposed to be warm, but not to the point <clears throat> where it feels like it's fucking killing me. I told you heat was a bad thing. You thought I was kidding. Now, who would rather be cold? Hmm. Yeah, mate. I, I get the feeling that my air conditioner is going to fucking die sometime later in the next month or so. Yeah, I told you, man. Whenever it gets too hot, that's when I. That's when you're gonna be like, okay, yeah, this is a bit much. That's what for me. No matter what, if it's fucking like twenty degrees, I'm like, dude, this is too much. For me. I really hope that air conditioner doesn't go out. It's a dinky little window unit, and I don't have the money to replace it. You hear that, everybody? Send me money. I need to replace shit. I also yeah, need to buy the money. wood to make myself a shelf to put me, uh, my telly on and store my DVDs and video game collections so it's easier to get to. Just uh, fucking send me money, true. everybody. Just shamelessly plug all. it, you know? I don't need it at all. Just, uh, you know. Give me money, too, but just give it to him. <laughs> give me money that I will give to him. Probably. We'll see. I'll take 99.99 .99 overdash plus point oh nine percent off the top for myself, but I'll give it to him. You see how that yeah. math worked out? <laughs> yeah, that was a great math. <laughs> uh, nah, but seriously, send me fucking money. He can get his shit fixed. I need he to buy toilet eat. paper. No, I really do. <laughs> <laughs> I really need to buy more toilet paper. I'm running really low. I've only got like one or two rolls left. <sighs> Oh, 
this ability don't give me enough because they wanted to give me for the psychological instead of the physical. Because, you know, yeah, I've realized bitches you over here literally... equally as greedy as Bobby Kotick. Yeah, I've realized that unless you're legitimately fucking dying, they're not gonna help you. Oh, dude, like, legit... they're not gonna help you even then. My sister, you remember that bit? She was legitimately fucking dying, and Disability Office, the Social Security Administration, didn't want to give her a single fucking penny. Hmm. They're even worse over there, I guess. They are yes. worse here in Alabama. This is the most crooked, ass-backwards state in America. And Listen, I can't fucking God, leave. If you give him money, he'd be able to leave, and he needs to. This shit I can't, because they'll put out a fucking um, extradition order on me, even if I try to get my uh, uh, fucking thing transferred. They'll have me arrested and throw me back in prison, and I'll fucking die in there again. It sucks being immortal when you can die. Um, what would they throw you in prison for? Because they want fucking money, and the only way they do it over here in Alabama is by manufacturing criminals, and then they get you to sign the paperwork, and if you actually read it, it ties into your Federal Reserve Bank account, and they take every fucking penny out of it. Hmm. Well, I'm saying, like, you should be able to leave the country. That's a thing. You can leave your fucking country. Dude... If I leave, I'm gonna claim fucking asylum because I am actually being treated as a fucking slave in this country. United States is a fucking slave colony. Always has been, always will be. And, you know, further proof of it, just one thing I'm gonna say, the Bar Association, that legal business, the first letter of the, the acronym BAR stands for British. A stands for accreditation. I forgot what the R stands for, but it's the British Accreditation. Or whatever the second funny. word is. It's something to do with accrediting. But it is British. The fucking bar is run by the fucking British Empire. America's a slave colony. Yeah. And when the fucking Civil War 3 breaks out over here, I don't want to be here. And yeah, it's gonna happen. There's gonna be a big fucking civil war over here again. Because people everywhere, are tired of the government being a complete bitch. It's gonna be everywhere, in fact. Not oh yeah, there. sorry. World War fucking 3. Where all the common people who are being enslaved are gonna overthrow their governments. It's happening already. No, it's happening while we're talking about it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Anyway, I don't give a fuck what they do. That's why I told you. As long you as they leave me out here, of it. If you could get this guy here money, he could probably leave the country he's in. Shit. And it wouldn't be that difficult. <clears throat> Yeah, mate, but I'm not going through the TSA at the airport. Oh, yeah, that's something else to talk about. The TSA. Well, you don't have to. Don't they have they, bridges and shit? They, they, <laughs> they, they manufacture this this uh, terrorist attack, as they call it. But it was really just, you know, they autopiloted the fucking planes. And then they set up the TSA, which doesn't stop foreigners if you're an american citizen and you go through the tsa you still have to be strip searched that makes no oh, fucking yeah. sense if the tsa is meant to keep foreigners from being from from fucking doing the, the suicide shit you think that they would let american citizens who were born here walk right through without being checked but no they strip search everybody including foreigners funny you know yeah, that's just Which proof that America is a fucking prison. Yeah, and usually half of them don't have anything. That's what's sad. Half of them are just if, trying to get back home. And they're, they're, they're abusing their so-called power at the TSA. 
They see someone with big tits, they're like, oh yeah, I want to strip search that person. So they make up a fucking excuse just to do it. Oh yeah. Hell, they've, they've even stolen things. people's registered items just because, you know, they wanted to. There's been numerous YouTube yeah. videos of it. I'm not going to quote every fucking example. Fuck off. Yeah, they've done that a lot, really. Um, I think what's fucked up is, is not only do they do that to uh, girls with the big tits, but they do that to guys, too. That's why I'm not going through the TSA. Just not at all. I will fucking... I would rather spend a few million dollars to charter a private jet with no searches, no bag checks. I'd rather waste the money on that than to go through the TSA like I'm in fucking prison again. Fuck that shit. They treat you or, just like you're in fucking prison. No different. Or if you just listen for a moment, or you could, this is just a big crazy thing. You could literally cross over via bridge. The bridge? Yeah, there's a bridge, you know. What bridge? Well, to wherever you would be going to, there is a bridge. And usually it's just a really low toll of money that You'd have to pay not much, really. You just have to give them money and you cross it. That's it. Usually it's like maybe $30. It's not even that much money. And how are you today? Mm. Well, I know where I want to I'm go, happy. but it's thousands of miles away, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I'd have to probably lay down in a few other places just to get there, but yeah, there's a, there's bridges, funny enough. And they're really cheap, like I said. They really are. They're fucking cheap. I started off doing the same thing. I just moved from place to place, and you know that. It's not like I'd moved there instantly. I legitimately had to cross bridges. I was like, nah, I'm not taking airplanes. <laughs> Fuck that. All is, I did was, you know, I, I would pay. rather go and pay a, f a few thousand dollar bribe to a, a cargo boat, like one of those 15 ton um, sh uh, cargo ships. I'd rather pay a bribe to the captain and get across that way and fucking sleep on the fucking floor than to go and get a first class flight. And go through the fucking TSA. The Toilet Seat yeah. Administration. South Park got it right there. It's the fucking Toilet Seat Administration. Because they treat you like shit. Oh yeah, they do. <laughs> They've been doing that for years. Mate, why the fuck haven't Americans risen up against this shit? You've been treating like you're fucking in prison all your life. There's cameras everywhere. Wake the fuck up. You're being treated like you're in prison already. Fucking oh, go yeah. on a revolution so, already. Make it bloody. Quite, quite, quite literally, if you walk outside right now, those freaking lights that you see outside have cameras in them. In fact, yeah, the fucking I've got street proof. lamps do. Yeah. I've That's even why got they put them this, everywhere. There's that, and also because of the light. I mean, I get that some people are needing light, but. <laughs> I don't really think you need that many lights on one When it's street. night time, it's time to sleep. Not, not time to light the oh. fucking dirt road up like a goddamn solar flare. For me, I walk around at night, but I can see. You can adjust your eyes. Pretty damn e simple. Yeah, even humans can do this shit. It's real fucking easy. It takes some practice, but... You just gotta make sure you're in a dimly lit room and just keep dimming the lights. That's it. My favorite way of doing it is to block off all the light possible and just sit there and wait, staring into the black nothingness. 
Okay, that's that's the way to do it. But usually, how how it works easier is the way I just said. Make sure well, you dim the easy. light. Yeah, it's a slow, gradual method to where you can notice the subtleties. But I like going for straight up just emptiness. What? That that's easy too. But you you dread with with these people. You'd probably you'd probably rather like I said do it that way. So it's a little easier. Yeah, mate. Oh yeah, another thing I watched on Brighter Side, they were talking about how scientists have um, been testing animals to see how they see, and fucking cuttlefish vision, mate. They have the ability to see multiple spectrums, but at the same time, they're only wired to see in black and white. Yeah, it's really crazy, isn't it? So the, do they see a superimposement of both? Yeah. Oh, that's fucking tits, mate. Yeah, their eyes are really interesting. They really are. Now they they also uh, believe that the frame rate, and I'm gonna call it that, the the speed at which you see, the frame rate at which you see, is directly proportionate to your size, body mass, and your me metabolic rate. No, that's not true. Uh, yeah, I can attest to that. It is definitely not true. It's attenuated by your your nerves in your brain, your central nervous system. Nervous system. Yeah. And it's also uh, attained with uh, all the factorization of using hand-eye coordination. And hand-eye coordination could go a lot of ways, in fact. Saying that you're getting your eyes coordinated and your hands coordinated. You could become like me and never have to look at your controller again. Oh, yeah, yeah. Or your keyboard on your computer or your keyboard if you're playing piano or your guitar for that they matter. They call that touch typing. To where you, where you yeah. know where the thing is and your, your muscle memory and your peripheral uh, nervous system stores the data in the nerve cells. And you just let your hands yeah. go across the keyboard? Yeah, that's how I've always been. If you start when you're young, like, as soon as you can fucking, you know, consciously recollect yourself, if you start doing that stuff when you're really young, you will be immensely skillful when you get to be older. And oh, why yeah. I say start when you're young is because... Up until you hit are. aged 18, for the human, the brain yeah, the brain, oh. for the human brain, the neurokinetics are constantly shifting and reconfiguring into new patterns. You're constantly absorbing information all the way up until you hit puberty. Which is usually at 18. And if you practice skills like touch typing and you know strumming a guitar or practicing on the drums kit if you practice a wide array of skills when you're young and keep building those skills and keep going at it all the way up and and you know just keep doing it even when you get older you will have those skills permanently oh yeah there's even you can earn different skills too it's, it's almost in fact like a game just about you can yeah, but, earn yourself tools, it's just reality. Yeah, and it's how you kinda earn like it leveling up, but in real life. You just You've got a brief it. window of opportunity to max out your skill uh, repertoire, and then you've got the rest of your life to build on top of that. Like, you can, you can learn how to make things levitate if you really wanted to. Shit, mate, that hey. requires a great deal of concentration. Oh, yeah. Like People Yoda like said, that. you have to have a most serious mind, but not not serious in the way that most Americans take it. Most Americans blow it out of fucking proportion. You have to be stern in your mental focus, not serious as in always being literal about everything all the fucking time. You have to be focused. You have to have a clear mind and be extremely focused. Make sure yeah. you know exactly what you're doing. 
you can't let random thoughts influence you, you, your mind and cause you to stray away from what you're focusing on. Oh, yeah. I, when you start focusing more and more, your brain's going to become even more and more intelligent. But at the same you're time, gonna... you know, practicing a wide array of skills, manage your time. Allocate yo so oh, much time to focus on this, and when that time's finished, then you put it away, save it for later. Next time you want to focus on it, next time you've set it up and scheduled for yourself to go and focus on it and move to something different. That way you've yeah, got this wide assortment of skills. Don't do everything all at once because that there could kill you. Quite literally, it could kill you. All at once. Yeah, don't try to do everything um together. Oh, yeah. Don't try to multitask. That's something that's uh, that's not really a thing. Yeah, it is so rare to actually be able to multitask that it's not really a thing. Yeah, I've learned how to do it, but it's taken a lot of years, in fact. Way too many, for that matter. Like, I could literally drive in a game like GTA <laughs> 5, look a joint, and eat all at the same time. Yeah, and let your girlfriend jump on your dick. I've yeah, actually been in a party with you when you were doing that. Yeah. I'll shake my head, but at the same time, looking back at those days, that was fucking hilarious. A lot of people's been in the party whenever I was actually uh, playing a game with just my feet. I was like, yo, you wouldn't believe it, but it's, it's actually true. If I could get a foot cam. Oh. Well, what about that time you were playing the controller with your dick? <laughs> That's a lot more difficult. <laughs> Define muscle tunement going that far down the, the spine. That's some serious fucking shit. Serious concentration is what it is. Some si yeah, some serious fucking concentration, mate. For you to fuck around with, literally, fuck the controller into doing what you want your character to do. Oh yeah. Right hey now, everybody, don't ever tell this guy to fuck the game. <laughs> you don't want to see that. <laughs> okay. Okay, the game itself, like, the inside of a game, probably not the best idea. I could definitely... Well, it's all, it's all electricity, electrical impulses. So, no, you wouldn't want to fuck that unless you were an electrical impulse yourself, but... You get what I'm saying here. <laughs> no, 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 I mean the inside of a game, like, literally, like, what we're playing right now, me fucking it over, making it look ridiculous or something, giving you a fucking monkey on your head. You know, there was a game, uh, some sort of thingy about robots, where we played as yokels, and you got a robot that literally humped your head. There was also another game, and we've played it quite often, GTA 5. It wasn't a monkey, but it was definitely a fucking tree. <laughs> you probably don't tree. remember it, but it was on the yeah, put a fucking uh, Christmas tree on your head and you started yelling about it. I, no, I don't remember that. You weren't, like, mad. You were just laughing and yelling all at the same time. Oh, shit, there's a fucking tree on my head. What the fuck, Joe? Shit, I remember... Words. Speaking of, I remember in GTA 4, some dickhead made a, uh, a dick in the shape... Uh, blocks in the shape of a dick around me. They did that on that game way too much. Yeah. Yeah, I, I can I can get behind yeah, it's fucking funny dickhead walking around. So yeah, I went and fucking teabagged his car like that. But then, you know, to pull out your fucking bazooka, blow me the fuck away every time I spawn and then when I shoot you, because I'm tired of you fucking around, for you to have God mode on, yeah, fuck off. I mean hacks and mods can be fun. But making it to where nobody can do anything to you and you're just being a bitch because you fucking can, fuck off. Yeah, I've never done that. 
And I won't. That's ridiculous. I don't need God mode. Not, not like that. God Shit, mode man. Is for time. It um, really is. It's even even when I played Ratchet and Clank, you know, the first time I went through it, I did the story, and I did it without using uh, what was that cheat code? Action replay or or uh, fucking I don't remember what it was. But after that, I was like, okay. So then I went through and I was like, yeah, I'm kind of tired of having to worry about ammo. I just want to blow shit up and have fun. So, yeah, I popped in the thingy and put it to where I could have infinite ammo on my guns. And yeah, that was fun. It's kind of like what, what uh, Sekiro uh, developers... If you haven't noticed a new episode, a new video from Jack Shadows Twice Shadows Die Twice. Yeah, yeah, if you haven't noticed, they actually allow you to use mods, which is awesome. I think every developer, if there's modders that are intelligent and not using it for bad things, which you can find this out really easily. Uh, yeah, it's called playing the game mod. you make. If you're a developer yeah. and you don't play the game you make you're useless trash. Fuck off. Oh, yeah. If sure. something's important to you, and yeah, this is a quote from Star Trek from Scotty when he's talking to Admiral James Tiberius Kirk. If something's important to you, you make the fucking time. And yeah, I added fucking oh, yeah. in just to accentuate how serious it really is. Oh, Syntax enhancement. Here. If something's important to you, you make the fucking time for it. So devs, and, and play just, your fucking games. If you don't enjoy them, to... why the fuck are you going to expect anyone to pay you for it? You. Just for shits and giggles here, though. There's no feckin' involved. Yeah, it's fuck, not feck. You hear me, Kevin? You hear me? We know you want to say it, Kevin. Say it, Kevin! Everyone will still understand, except for YouTube Susan Wajiki Board. I forgot her name too. <laughs> Widgie Board. Susan Widgie Board, fucking bitch CEO queen of YouTube. Yeah, there, I said I don't it. Know her name. Cause that's what she is. She's a fucking bitch queen. <clears throat> she doesn't have any morals. All she gives a fuck about is money. Just like Bobby Kotick. Maybe they should fuck each other. That's a match made have in hell. Fuck, baby. Yeah, have a little vicious fuck baby demon jizz spawn. That only eats money. Has no teeth. Just eats money. Yeah, it would be... <laughs> And we're saying this and fucking having a giggle over it, but you know how YouTube's going to be. They're going to be like, oh, we're, we, we can't allow you to do that. We're going to censor you, you shit, mate. We're going to take your video down. Fuck off, YouTube. Without content creators, you don't have jack shit. You're not even a company in yourself. You're literally... You're, you're a, a product product. that people use to share things with each other. And that's what we're doing. So fuck off, Susan, widgy board, bitch queen. Fuck off. We're sharing a laugh and a talk right now, which is literally the freedom of speech. <clears throat> yeah, constitutional right to the freedom of fucking speech, bitch. And all these people who think it's wrong to say bad words, as you call it, like cussing bitch, or dick, nigger. Ass, tits, cunt, pussy. There, have I None said enough these, yet? <laughs> none of these words are bad words. They're just no. words. That's all they. And if you're going off the four-letter word trip, love is a four-letter word. So fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah, and that's right the, in your ass. That's even the worst one, in fact, because it means absolutely nothing. It's just a fucking lie. Yeah, it's not only a lie, it's literally a word that is an embodiment of, hey, we want money. Yeah, that's Quite why literally. Valentine's Day exists. Yeah, why do you think there's a fucking Valentine's Day? Why do you think it's so sought after? 
All the holidays are just a fucking trip for money. It's really sad because people think that it's a real thing because they say it so much to people that they think. It's a mantra. Low. It's something you repeat until you believe it. That's what a mantra is. It's a brainwashing technique. Repetition. And yeah, really repetition think... can be useful to build your memory and build new skills if you're past uh, the point where your brain isn't uh, arranging its neurokinetics. You know, once you get to a certain age, your brain neurokinetics stop and you have to use repetition to input new skills and new things into yourself. All so I'm it's saying a tool. Is just think, yeah, just think about it for a moment. Why would any of the so-called holidays be a holiday? Yeah, and why would they commercialize it so much? Why would they want you to buy cards and shit for it? Yeah, what's sad is that's actually the only holiday besides Christmas. Christmas and that day is the only fucking holiday, as it were, that they do that with. On Halloween. Halloween they don't, yeah. No, they don't do that with it anymore. They've really? stopped doing commercials for Halloween. I've noticed. 100%. They've stopped. They pretty much stopped Halloween in general. They weren't making enough money with it. People were legitimately getting afraid because no, no, these they... fucking... The, yeah, oh yeah, the razor blades and needles and candy and shit. Who yeah. the fuck would do that? That's just stupid. People that do do that. Why? What, what is the point? The fuck is wrong with you? If you put razor blades and needles into candy and gave it out to children, <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you, mate? Halloween was about having fun, dressing up in a costume, and getting candy. Those are the fucking things that children used to fucking adore. Also, Hell, the whole situation of being scared of... Joe and I still love crap. fucking candy. Not fucking candy, oh, yeah. but, you know, eating candy. Why the fuck would you want to put also, razor blades and shit in it? afraid of uh, the freaking clowns. You shouldn't be afraid of those guys. They're not going to hurt you. Not unless they're as the killer clowns from outer space. You remember that movie? <laughs> that freaked me out when I first saw it. Do you remember that? Yeah, I loved it. It was one of my favorite movies in the world. Yeah, I've, I've realized you, being who you are, you love these horror movies and you consider them to be comedies. However, <laughs> me, I'm just like, the fuck? Yeah, I get why but you, also, but what the fuck, mate? What is wrong with you? Also, not only you, other people are like, okay, this is terrifying. This is, like, literally, like, stuff of nightmares. And I'm like, hey, good thing, huh? I don't even have nightmares. I make people have them, but I don't have them. <laughs> mate, you just... You, you're as insane and crazy as I am, but it's off to the side, not on the same pedestal. Oh, there's pedestals. Yeah, mate, there's fucking pedestals. Pedestal primes. Hashtag callback. Uh, maybe, uh, maybe in a few more games of this after we get a little bit more bored as I am. It's a great time to actually talk and stuff. Uh, after that, though, we should go off and play some uh, the, oh, the new missions. Yeah. Yeah, this is what they did in the Old West. You know, they sit down with their friends and have a card game and they just dipshit talk with each other about what they did, how their day was, you know, just basic fucking friends shit. I mean, not friends like the TV show, that was fucking absurd. Some of that shit was hilarious. You remember Phoebe Buffay, the vampire layer? That shit was fucking tits. I've never watched the show. I'm not gonna you lie. You never it's seen sort of Friends? Like... No, what the fuck is wrong with like... you? You've been living under a rock during the 90s. No, no do, I'm sorry. Do you I'm not... sorry. You actually were living under a rock. Sorry about that. I was gonna say, do you remember? I don't much like shows like this. I like. I like really ridiculous shit. <laughs> well, I like really interesting things to me, but you might say it's stupid, like Frasier. Also, the other show, what was it? The Big Bang Theory or whatever? Yeah. The, the jokes there is that 
Sheldon Cooper is a fucking idiot. And he really fucking is. He's a socially inept idiot. But the big joke of the show is these socially inept nerds learning to socially interact the way quote unquote normal and yeah I did the fucking Dr. Evil finger bit like tractor beam normal people yeah the socially inept nerds learning to interact socially Normally. in the way that normal people do yes Harry <laughs> Oh, you're gonna have to repeat that. It's Levioso. Not Nya. They say Nya just so we could say it's Levioso. Levioso. No. Oh, stop it, Ron. Fucking hell. We need to get Oni son in here, you know? Oni NG cartoons. We need to get him in here and fucking have tits all laughs. Chris O'Neill is his name. Neil? His name is Neil. Chris? No, Chris? Christopher O'Neill. Christopher O'Neill. I'll say that little, little bit of a. Fucking uh, willy nilly here. <laughs> I've always wondered why the uh, way he came up with Baxter. Christopher O'Neill. Why he came up with the whole Christopher O'Neill is just like James Baxter from um, Adventure Time. Yeah, he just wants sure. to make people laugh. <laughs> that's one of the best medicines. Robin Williams said it. Yeah. Multiple times and in a fucking movie. Oh, yeah. That's literally one of my favorite movies, Patch Adams. And sometimes I use my dick as a pogo stick. He, he said that just to see if the asshole was listening and he wasn't. <laughs> yeah. That's why I liked Robin Williams. He added his own little flair. Dude, every time Robin Williams ad libbed and he did it so often in movies, it was fucking comedy it. platinum, mate. Fuck oh, gold. Yeah, they... It was comedy platinum. Oh, yeah. It's funny because whenever he did it, too, no matter if they wanted to go with it or not, they fucking had to. Or he would say, no, I'm well, doing it again. Except in um, um, Mork and Mindy. It was so long ago, and bullshit um, censorship was so strict back then that they couldn't let him say shit, so he said shuzbot. He still had to say something of the sort, though. That's the case. Nanu nanu. The nanu nanus. Maybe he knew them, Robin. Ruben Williams. And yeah. Okay, oh, yeah. let's leave this one. And uh, go do some missions. Alright, give me. Thanks for the money, six dollars. <laughs> hey, no worries, mate. We'll go make it back in a mission. Come on. Yeah, I'll start it. Well, I have to invite you to a kajigger. Yeah, yeah. Kajigger it is. Alright, uh, let's see here. Chat, I have to look for you and invite you to my game and then. And then do a tingy. I'm on Xbox, you can do it alone. There you are. Hey, it was fun doing the whole uh, poker, though. I'm glad it works now. That's, that's a oh, great no. fucking thing. Someone else has got a fucking red name and tag on them. Because they've run around killing idiots for no reason. No, not idiots. They just run around killing people like an idiot for no reason. Fucking hate that. If you want to run around killing people for no raisins, get your fucking ass in Call of Duty where you belong. Fuck off. I don't have time for it. Me and me friend, we want to fuck around doing dipshit things. Fuck off. Oh, yeah. And if you really are going to be a bitch and fucking harass us like that one idiot, Vitable, did, mate, 
You deserve whatever the fuck Joe decides to do to you. Alright, I'm gonna run over here and get some ammunition. Then we can start up a mission. I'm just gonna run, I'm not gonna take a horse. Mate, it's I wouldn't like... blame you if you decided to launch a goddamn Scud missile at these idiots, you know? I know Damn, you can not... do that. I just... I wouldn't blame you if you did. <laughs> I'm just gonna run this way, though. If you wanna follow me, you can. I'm gonna walk. Nonchalantly so. And hope that we're I'm not walking. permanently stuck in a bad sport lobby like what happened uh, earlier when you were testing things. Did you do a finalization on your report on that, by the way? On what now? On the bad sport lobby that they opened up to plug people into who just ran around killing for no reason. Yeah, I did. I was telling them about it and letting them know that it's a good thing that it's, it is going to be a thing, you know. But they need to finalize and make it proper. Yeah, to where it puts you there for a certain amount of time instead of permanently. Yeah, I'll be sitting over here. I'm going to get me some ammunition. And habitual offenders, two strikes, and you're fucking permanent on the third. Fuck this three strike not rule bullshit. It needs to be harsher. It needs to be an actual deterrent instead of a oh yeah, well la da. That rule of three yeah, bullshit that's religiously adhered to. Fuck that nonsense. Two strikes, you're out. I'm gonna get me some express rounds because that's the best one you could get. What rank do you have to be to buy that stuff? I really don't like how things are rank locked in, in these games. I, I really don't like it. Yeah, I don't either, but... I don't like it, but at the same time, I'll deal with it. At least we could actually do actual things like play poker. Now, since we've got poker, though, here's the thing. Now they need to make it to where poker actually gets you leveled up and shit. Why? We just do it for fucking fun, mate. Because I would like to get ranked up in poker setting. Like, you know what I'm saying. I don't you mean like a poker skill level or something? Yes. Or, no, wait, no, not a skill. A fucking set of challenges. Yeah, or something like that, yeah. That'd be great. Yeah. The bulldog. I should get some ammunition if you don't have like some. Like the, the last and highest challenge, which would be a fucking gold or fucking platinum diamond encrusted belt buckle, would be to get four fucking aces. To have a bulldog. That would be fucking tits, wouldn't it? Oh yeah. Alright, so now if I go to Posse, Doc Stiffy, <laughs> Dog Stiffy. Oh uh, yeah, I was, I was looking at my character name the other day, and I, I was I was just thinking about Welcome. it. I How named my do? character Doo Doo Butt. Huh. That's fucking tits, isn't it? <laughs> I think it sent you an invite. Yeah, it sure did. I right, just make it sure. Um, hey, mate. You there we go. Hey, look. There's a guy behind you. All right, let's go, dude. Oh yeah, there is a guy behind me. I gotta figure out how to get to those things now. So if I go to progress, story missions, the one that we need to start up is. Now, originally, when I named my horse Jean, she was a female. Um, let's go and check and see if she has those balls that, you know, magically appeared. Okay, yeah, she's female as she should be. Originally, whenever I got my horse, it wasn't even a horse at all, it was a broomstick. A broomstick? Shut up, Harry! 
Strong... <laughs> anyway, there was that one time where my horse changed sex for no reason. I was like, what the fuck? I bought a female horse. Why does she have balls? Uh, uh, guess what I can do? What? You'll see. I think that the, uh, the people over at Rockstar worked so diligently on those balls that they accidentally, inadvertently, subconsciously put in a system that, you know, put the balls onto every horse. <laughs> I don't know why, but I think that's what happened. You want balls on your horse? Hey, how you doing? You see, a, you see something strange here? I bought a female horse. Why does it have testicles? No, no not that. Something strange. Look at Your the skin freaking texture. Cheek. No, you idiot! Look how many people are in the game. It's just the two of us. <clears throat> just the two of us. We can make it, <clears throat> but don't die. Young just Tom the two Davis. of us. You you and I. Hang him for it was and was before we wouldn't even able to do this. Yeah, it was random. All four had it. slots had to be full. Tell order it don't exist no more in this chaos of a world. They got him in tumble. This isn't even the first one that you're supposed to do, but I don't care. It's one that gets you money. This is what matters. Guess you'll have to figure that out. Do you want to skip this? It's fine. It's going to be over in like three seconds. Two, one, zero. Let's go. Now, I hope you're ready to shoot, because that's what's gonna have to happen. Why here. can't I, like, fucking jump mount my horse from from the rear? Like, you see people do in movies. Do I have to be running you mean full like sprint? No, you just have to walk up behind it and push wire. You don't hold wire or anything, just push it up with it. Uh, Don't worry about that right now. Team lives so we're two, that means we can only die one person. No, we can only die twice. Uh, we get only to zero lives, it doesn't matter. We still, we, we could still play the game, but we'll get less money. So let's not die. He jumped over a bush. Here we are. Get ready Thank you for pointing that out. I was just uh, literally Yeah, it's realistic, but at the same time, you, too, sure. in the game, it's, it's a little extra effort. Alright, so this, this is ridiculous. I find it to be Can I shoot the fucking rope and cut it that way? I'm, I'm gonna try that. Well, you probably can, but we're not gonna need to. Let's not worry about that yet. We have to kill people. That's the thing right now. So okay. hide and let's shoot the fuck out of people. It started in I'm gonna move in, let's go over here. Got one. Again. You, you gotta get a couple kills too, that's why I'm not killing them all. Had to... Oh, fuck. I'm gonna use a health real quick, hold on. You mind watching my back right quick? Got another. Damn, I don't have any food. Um, if they put it in to where I can give you food. Not yet. Okay. We're clear in the immediate area. Let's go. We 
We're doing pretty good, actually. We're just two of us. It's supposed to be on the Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice and again, shot. we work with There we go. What? Marshall Davis? How the hell did he die? Yeah, how the fuck did he die? Checkpoint. Uh, I pushed it for a moment and it didn't work. There we go. Seriously, how the fuck did he die? Wasn't he with us? I don't know. All right, we, we need to get in here and shoot the... Listen here. I, I get killers. it. Shut up. Kind of killers. We both held A at the same time to skip that one, didn't we? Yeah, we, we gotta get to Marshall. That's Marshall Davis, the guy that's in here. We, we gotta get him and we gotta shoot him off or something. I picked a pretty easier mission, but I just picked the mission that we get money. Moving up. I'm gonna try to. Yeah, I'm already moving. Don't worry about me. Where's my gun? It just went invisible. I'm going to Marshall. I'm distracting these idiots. Got him. Can you kill off all those people or no? Uh, I'm, I'm working on it. I'm reloading. Got two of them down. I gotta give up. Like Don't worry about me. We got one more life. Come on. Come on, my boy. Reload. Come after me. Come on, dude. You can do it. I believe in you. Come on. You can't let me die this time. Let's hold Y to revive. I thought it was X. <clears throat> then we gotta go and uh, get these fucks. You say you get him, I'm gonna get the top. Come the fuck on! <clears throat> Alright, I need to get some help. We're gonna let those animals chase us out of tumble. So I need a I'm gonna get right here. You could run up in uh, front of them, dude, and, uh, like, start shooting people as soon as you see them if you wanted to. I can't do much at the moment. I'm trying to get this help, dude. Health items. Shit. Fuck it. 
I got ran over. Alright, we gotta go, dude. Fuck. Two speed, where I couldn't. Shit. I'm running, dude. Yeah, man. I'm trying to catch up to him. People behind us, but fuck it. You know they're a terrible shot, literally. Yeah. Like the worst. Ow, fuck shit. I've ever yeah. Seen. Fuck the fucking done. Me too. Shit. God, fucking damn. Okay, uh, I need to get on the fucking wagon this time. Just, I'm gonna give up. What's it? Replay? No, no, no. Re try a checkpoint. Okay. Don't worry about it right now. We'll worry about getting it gold. If we get it gold, then we'll get even more money. But we'll worry about that later. I, that's why I got on the wagon. We're running to a place I know about the river. Oh seriously? I can't use my big guns. I have to use my my uh, six shooter. Yes. Okay, I can shoot behind us. Well, that's about it. Dude, you could have stood up where I am. It's the same difference. How do I? We're going all of. I'm certainly not while we're moving. But when we were going. All right, here comes the people. My God, I wish you guys were not. Was it X to reload? I got him. We're gonna have to take care of a lot of these fucks in a moment. Oh, I see that. They're everywhere on the map. Got one too, long shot. We'll make a nice. All right, we're gonna stop right here and get off. The, get off this fucking thing. Let's go. Nice beta reload. Are we getting onto the I train? No, we're not. We're killing these fucks. We gotta stand our ground. So, uh, help me out here. I'm shooting, mate. Your gun sucks. Oh, no, fuck, I'm down. Really sucks. Uh, 
You think you can pick me up or no? <sighs> I have no food, so I can't, like, heal myself. That's why I'm down in a lot. Fuck. Shooting me, you're shooting through me. All right, trying to get in a wagon a minute. No, I don't want on the fucking get off that. I want up here. Come, come on, jump in. For fuck's sake. That guy came up out of nowhere, dude. Yeah, he did. Come on! I'm reloading. Me too, dude. Shit. I headshot my like guy. <laughs> that guy just fucked. Holy bullshit. How many do we have to kill? Fucking hell. Well, because it's just the two of us, a lot more. Hit that guy. Okay. Fuck off, horse. I'm tired of aiming at you. Wait till you see how much fucking level up the money is this will show. For you, since you're new to it. Reloading. It shouldn't take that fucking long to reload, dude. Shooting him in the ass. I think I shot that guy's horse and he just sort of flew off of it. Oh, thanks. That guy almost had me. Okay, I need to heal up. Okay, I'm good. We're almost done. Holy shit, I can't believe I just got that guy. Oh, I fucking ranked up on killing these idiots. This this is a lengthy shootout, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It's a very long shootout. Tired of the horses being in the way. Alright, we got like three or four more that I can count. Oh shit! Where am I being shot at from? 
I don't know, one of the guys on the wagon just being an idiot? There was one of them. What the fuck, game? My second thought was someone with a fucking scope on a long rifle. Hey, mate, while you can, scavenge some of these bodies for some healing items. Well, this is as much as we have to do. Oh. Where do we go now? I'm gonna go over here and kill the rest of them. Don't tell me he's glitched again. He could be very well glitched. He's glitched! Son of a bitch! Sorry, right, come here. Look. I want you to see this shit. He's actually glitched right here. Look. I don't see anything. You come at me in my town? He's actually glitched, though. Okay. I'll take your word for it. Only thing we could do is actually kill ourselves, though. That's what's fucked up. So who is it that's glitched? One of the guys we have to get moving. Yeah, it's the sheriff himself. One guy who has an eye patch sitting up holding the reins, and the other dude is standing next to the wagon. For me, he's running into the wagon, which means he glitched. Oh. Like I said, the only way to fix that is by killing ourselves. Well, that's fucked up. Yes. Before I do that, though, before either of us try to do I that, I found I'm Desert just... Sage. Nice. Before either of us try to do that, though, I'm gonna loot these fuckers. Because we could retry from the checkpoint and keep doing this and actually loot the people. Oh, okay. In that case, I'll grab one. So somehow or another, one of us is going to have to kill ourselves. I can't kill myself. I can't aim at my foot and shoot myself. <laughs> you have grenades or anything on you? Like yeah, fiery. I got a stick of dynamite. Uh, I'm going to just go over here and... Um... Like I said, unfortunately, we're glitched, people. If I could show you my end of the whole entire thing, you'd be able to see it. But, well, so watching that happen was something else, I'm not gonna lie. You have to kill yourself three times, by the way, so. Oh, fucking wild carrots. Hang on, I'll pick those. Am I gonna keep this stuff? You'll keep all of it.
Yeah, this glitch is by accident, in fact. Creeping time. You want some creeping time? I think we should get over the whole glitch so we can get through this and get you some big time money. Or at least it should. I just wanted to walk over and like, what the? As you were blowing yourself up. My hat flew off! <laughs> Alright, now you gotta do it one more time. I like how every one of them just look exactly the same, wearing the same hat and the same clothes. How do you throw dynamite? Uh, you just do the same thing. Retraction All right. point. Alright, hopefully he doesn't glitch this time. He can't get scared. We can't let him get scared? I'm pressing B to jump in there, but it's just not jumping. Oh my fucking god, why is it rolling off without me? Oh, for fuck's sake. Fuck you, AI driver! Might want to call your horse, bud. Sheriff Freeman, old man. Sort of point. Her name is Bader Freeman. On Discord. Um... Also, shooting people get you leveled up, so... Sorry, bud. There's somebody right behind you. Call him my horse just in case. Fuck, I ran out of ammo. Shit. Oh, shit. Man, that's a very bad thing. There's somebody behind you again. Alright, let's hope he doesn't... Don't you come over here, you fuck. You better stay over here somewhere. Switch the fucking target! God damn! How many times do I have to fucking put a bullet into this bitch? I emptied two fucking full sixes! I don't know, but I kinda wish that 
Oh man, I just died. Son of a bitch, man. <sighs> that didn't even give me a fucking chance. I just straight up died. I got three of them. Thanks. Fuck, he's glitched again. Are you serious? Hey. You're fucking with us. Damn, dude, I need to... I need to fix that. <laughs> I can send you a picture of this if you don't want to believe me. I'm actually being honest with No, you. they need Good. to fix that. Oh, he does. I mean, they do. They all do. That's bullshit. If he gets too fucking scared, then he won't fucking do anything. He'll just try to hide. Whenever he tries to hide, it glitches him. It makes it look like he's okay for you. But for me, he's stuck in one spot. God damn, yeah, they're out of my range and pulling fucking long shots. I'm killing as many as I can, man. Out of fucking bullets. I don't want to focus on their goddamn horses, I want to focus on them. He's glitched again, but we could actually get a lot of kills out of this, so... I didn't want to loot that guy. Wasn't trying to loot. I pushed the reload button and my guy looted. Yeah, <laughs> this is getting intense, though. Yeah, it is. Just, I don't really care for being intense at the moment. I killed the guy. Oh, it's horse. I'm healing up. I can't go up. Dude, I'm running out of ammo. I've got seven bullets left. 137. Yeah, I'm gonna have to loot somebody soon. Nice shot. I'm looting. Me too.
kind of hope if we have to do this again, it doesn't glitch again. I mean, it's cool and all, because we're just getting kills out of this and levels and shit. But I kind of want to get the mission done. <coughs> you think these assholes would have more um, bullets on them, you know? Sand Especially since they're infinite. coming after us. And also they're an infinite bullet storm pretty much. Yeah. And I wish I could show you this, but he's literally just running in a circle right here where I am. Why is every last one of these named Del Gabo? Because it's it's just like that. It's really dumb. Did you shoot that guy off of his horse? Yeah. I'm going on your left to loot these two. Alright. What's cool is we could actually do this as many times as we want. By the way, you didn't kill yourself uh, another time, so we could just do this because it's zero lives. So all you gotta do is get shot. Still can't. <clears throat> sure. That's why I'm just running to the reds. I don't care. We're glitched anyway, so what's it matter? I'm going over here and killing some people. Okay, I'm gonna go and try and get killed. Okay. How fucking far away is this shit? I don't know, but I'm killing the fuck out of people with just my knife. Hmm. I think I should have ran over there near you. Two guys here. Hmm. They were not great because I literally just walked up to them and shanked them with my knife. They didn't even get to put a shot out. I think what's nice is we could do this mission as much times as we want. But saying it's extremely boring. It's boring what? because that glitch isn't letting us finish it. Hey, I'm about to get hit by a train. I ran I just, straight uh, into it. I wish you could have saw where I just like stabbed 13 people when you said that. <laughs> I'm about to get hit by a train. And I stabbed 13 people in a row, killing them. Oh, what is it to jump into the wagon? We're to a the river. Oh my god, it didn't let me jump on. They just immediately took the fuck off. Again, eggs. You're bad, Dean, coming back at you. Eggs. Hi. Eggs. Got it. Shut up. Stop taking the piss. Dude, I'm gonna max out my fucking 
kills challenges just from this one mission glitching alone. Yeah, we both and, are. Um, yeah, I'm out of fucking rifle bullets. <laughs> and I've got 20... I've got 30 fucking regular... Uh, uh, okay, I just... Rounds. So, and it gave me a... What? Excuse me? We can't let him get scared, that's the only thing, and it's so gay! Why should we have to worry about him being scared? That's probably the only thing I don't like about this. Is that you have to worry about making him scared, which is retarded. Nice shot. Reloading. Why doesn't he have a fucking gun? Yeah, I have a lovely view of your ass. I really can't shoot through it, mate. I, I can't help that, dude. I'm trying to take out these guys. Dude, if you would've just saw that, I got like 17 headshots. I'm shooting oh, with your ass in my face. <laughs> fucking crazy, isn't it? And I'm actually being somewhat effective. We better not get stuck again, damn it, game. If we do, I quit this mission. I'm gonna start a different one, because that's just ridiculous. Mate, we're fucked. I'm out of ammo. We just can't let him get too close to the fucking wagon. Don't let him get too close to the wagon. Oh my god, dude. What? They're going off without us? What the fuck? Pick me up! Yeah, I'm working on what it. What the hell, dude? Oh Lord. my fucking god. Why are they fucking leaving us? Why is this mission shit? Never mind, we did it. Wow. At least it finished instead of saying, Oh, you didn't keep up with the posse. You failed. I wasn't sure about you, Mr. Jones. Then you went and saved my neck. Just skip it. Well, I'm done. Oh, oh, fucking you. damn. That is the fucking shit, mate. Glitch locked. Well, what people call soft lock. Twice in a row. And then the fucking Pretty wagon takes off without us. I did it three times, and then the wagon took off without us. Oh yeah, it triple fucking soft locked, and then the wagon takes off without us. That is, that is fucking shit. That mission needs a, a fucking overhaul. Yeah, I think what's good though is that we are going to get a little bit more money and RP and all, but for that effort, my god. That didn't give me anything. In fact, never mind. How much should it give you? I, I, I didn't see. Oddly enough, neither did I, so I assumed it didn't give me anything. 
All right, let's go to this uh, fast travel thing over here. I'm gonna, let's go to the, uh, let's go to wherever it's called. Where we usually go, stand and eat. Okay. I've got $207. I didn't get shit out of that mission. I told you. That's why I said, what the fuck? That they mission is fucking me. glitched, mate. That's bullshit. There's first way too many glitches in that mission, and it's unfucking yeah. playable. First time I did that mission, if you let me fucking speak for a moment, first time I did that mission, it actually didn't give me 200 and some odd dollars. This time, it gave me 10 cents. I mean, yeah, cool and all, it gives you level up from killing people, but... Really? I don't think I don't think it's worth it. We can oh, get mate. level up. That was not worth the effort. No, it wouldn't, especially losing all of our fucking ammo. Yeah, we're losing money playing that mission. You lose more money than you fucking gain, and that's not what it's supposed to be about. I'm gonna go to San Denis. You can come with me if you want, but I'm just going there because I like it there more than anywhere else. Which would be obvious, but you see what I'm talking about, though. Now people don't really fuck with each other because of what's going on. If you actually kill too many, or if you even kill one person now, and made it to where you could be hunted down immediately. Alright, we're going to Shandini. Eleven dollars. <laughs> <clears throat> Yesterday it was five, now it's eleven. Doesn't make really any sense. No. I mean, after you initially used the, the fucking fast travel bit for, you know, that premium sense. price, it should go down. Should be free. Did I get it back in the day? It wasn't free to travel. What are we gonna do now? Um, I don't know, man. That mission is a bust. I yeah, could that start mission up a bust. If you would like. A different one? Uh, yeah, a different one. No, after all that, after that nonsense, I mean, I, I just, I'm fucking burnt out on that particular garbage. I need to take yeah, a fucking that... break from it. Hey, let's go fishing and hunting. That also gets you leveled up. Yeah, I'm I'm just you know fucking stoked on the idea of hitching a wagon to my horse and loading up a fucking wagon with animals that I've hunted down, and then you know selling it all to the butcher. Yeah, I can't wait for that to be. That's gonna be awesome. Uh, it sure is fucking foggy, I'll tell you that. Right, as it stands with the mission being fucked in the ass, hunting and fishing not... is still the only way to get money in the game. One of the only ways. Also poker, but that I think poker is just for fun. Nah, it's just for shits and tits, mate. Because you're not really making much. You're making what five dollars if you play with your friends, but if you play with other people, oh, there's a gator. But if you play with other people while playing alongside your friends, you can still earn a lot of money. 
saying you'd be playing twenty four dollars when everybody else would be too. So that would be nice. Level 36 now, because I killed a gator. As I said, it's nice to get leveled up and all from those, from that mission, but for that effort, it's not. And that was, that was not Deadpool style maximum effort. That was just bullshit. Because getting stuck in the same fucking area, same time, every fucking time. Yeah, that kind of grind is bullshit. That's, that's kind of like fucking Warframe at that point. Yeah. yeah. I've seen six updates in that game across the year I've played it. And it just keeps getting grindier and grindier and I'm, I'm fucking done. Cat, you named your horse Warlord. Yeah, I did. Thought that'd be a cool name. This fog is getting a little annoying. Only three fucking gators? Wow, that's Hey, I got a heron. Nice. There was only three gators apparently. And only one of them was perfect. Right. Picking it up and selling it, you know, just Without skinning it or anything, how much am I gonna get? How much? S six more cents than you would probably get if you just took the feathers. I'm probably gonna go and take this gear skin and stuff. Alright. and all as well. I I'm just glad <clears throat> the fucking poker works if anything. Right, that that um, that problem that we ran into, being as rampant as it is in every game, soft locking, glitches that make it to where you don't want to play it, that's why people turn to duplication and infinite money glitches. Yeah, it sure is, because because they want to get somewhere, it. and they're losing profit, repeating By the same garbage. So, duplication and money glitches is usually the answer. <clears throat> and that's a glitch. What we were experiencing is a big time glitch. It is a bad glitch. And that's not even a good glitch either, that's what's sad, you're right, it's a bad glitch. If it was a good glitch, it would actually work in our favor. The only thing it does is give us level up. But we were trying to get money. Which... Yeah, we were doing the mission help. to get the mission money. And I'd Not never done mission. that mission before. And it was just it fucking did. bullshit. And he only got like about 10 cents. That's about it. I'm gonna buy me some. No, food. I didn't even make profit. I net loss. Oh shit, there's people shooting. Fucking great. What can I do for you? 
A dollar thirty. Okay. Like they jumped off the train and all four of them turned red. Okay. Lil Philip sixteen. Uh yeah, press charges. And uh respawn. Wait, you can press charges? Yeah, I press charges on them. <laughs> Did they kill you or start shooting you? Yeah, they started shooting me. I didn't do nothing. I was just going to the fucking uh the place to get me some food, man. Right. Okay, so this guy, uh, report. Yeah, disruptive behavior. Yeah, there you go. <coughs> well, good news. I've spawned in close ish to, um, the gunsmith, so I can go and refill my bullets. Uh, very nice. I'll meet you over there. Yeah, they just jumped off the fucking train and immediately just started shooting at me. All I was doing was walking into the fucking, uh, the place to get me some food. Actually, I'm a, oh, you I'm a flea. Yeah, welcome. My horse. Get out of here, horse. I don't want you to get killed. Don't show me what to do. Unique right. weapons. It's... Not as unique as you think it is. Yeah, I can't see these uh, high-velocity pistol cartridges if they're rank-locked for me, because the price is over the top of it. Like, ah, there it is. They're not much. I made a net loss of yeah, like twenty dollars in that mission. I made a net loss of at least two hundred dollars in that mission. Oh, yeah, including the actual money that the mission's supposed to give you. Yeah, two hundred and twenty dollars net loss. Exactly. That should never fucking happen in any game. I don't give a fuck if it's World of Warcraft or not. Never. <clears throat> Even if it's a game that's just glitchy, it shouldn't happen. Lamat Revolver. Oh, yeah. It's a, it's a nice one. I got the High Roller Revolver. It's really nice. Only way you can get it is if you go to the, uh, the other guy, the one dude. I didn't even do anything. I walked in the store, he just goes, hey! What are you doing in here? We have a lot of guns. You better be respectful.
Yeah, I've got the fucking bolt action and the rolling block. That fucking Carcano, though. Please, keep looking. I'm just chilling outside waiting for you. I don't even have enough money to start up another fucking, uh... Looks like just been taking playing poker, dude. Time. I could fit some different stocks of you. Could make it more comfortable on the shoulder. Howdy. Do you have enough ammunition for that? You know, day? trying to tell on me was a bad idea. <sighs> Howdy, good sir. So many people don't. Hey, uh, cop, how you doing? I've got some better stocks that would fit that gun. Can add to stability. I'm not going to stop it. You guys brought this on yourself. <laughs> oh, Sounds like you're having fun out there. I'm a little stuck at the moment, though. I can see you look after your firearm. Sir, I'm sorry, but mm. I'm not sorry. I... I have some better quality components if you're looking see for the you best. Break for it. You're dead, you cocksucker. Seriously, they're calling you a cocksucker in this game? It's bad enough we get that bullshit in GTA. We don't need it here. You stupid or something? I didn't even say that word usually back in the day. Yeah. Take that out, Rockstar. That's bullshit. I get enough of it in GTA. I don't want it in this game. You won't find a better selection of firearms this side of the river. Oh boy, I got a bounty here, but that's fine. I didn't do nothing wrong. Just killed a couple of people, that was all. Glad to see you're taking care of it. So many people don't. I can do some nice ornate engraving on there. If you like, good price. Just killing people all that bad. I can't put on my bandana. Engravings. I, I didn't do anything. Why do I have your attention? What the hell? Forty-two dollars to buy that. I'm glad this isn't costing me gold. We stock some of the finest quality guns in the south. There's a lot of fucking shit that does cost gold. Plenty of lively bars nearby. Be sure to take back. a gun. <clears throat> a hunting knife. Yeah, let's screw around with this.
Your horse is in the same place, funny enough. I hope this will bring more people to Chinatown, but I am still waiting. That looks nice. I like the way that looks. There's the guy. The fence. That's who you go to to get the gun I was talking about. Which is a great gun. The fence. Okay. That's where I am right now. Shit, mate. It looks like those assholes buggered the fuck off. Mm -hmm. Nice. About time they buggered the fuck off. I got eleven frickin' dollars. It's called the High Roller Revolver. Oh, you can get... Dude, that's cool. You can get the, the jawbone knife now. First time, sir. Of course. Fucking ambient Welcome inclusion much. Hundred and ninety dollars yeah. or eight Bought gold. It Bought it with eight gold. Saying it's a really good gun, and I didn't want to not say oh yeah to it because it's a good gun. I'm over here with your horse. Hey, nice. Jawbone knife. Uh, that one's a knife. I already know what it looks like. It's in the story if you find it. You actually find a lot of things in the story. <laughs> Why is okay. it still barking? Did you say barking? No. Why is it so foggy? I don't know. Uh, what do I have that I can sell okay, to? Let's see your wares. Uh, I won't ask lunch. where it came from. Um, mate, you're not currently near my horse. Not now, no, I moved. Wanted to go hunting. Oh, but you know, I like to hunt. I just killed a perfect gator that was one of the big gators that you could see in the game. And it gave me the max amount of stuff. Is that mm. new? Yeah, it is.
That's cool. What are you trying to hide from? <clears throat> Unless you want trouble, take that mask off now. That's it. Keep going. Antagon I didn't antagonize anybody. I was just rolling through. I was just running by. And it says I antagonized somebody. Fuck off. If you bump into somebody, like, slightly tap them with your shoulder, it's an antagonization, apparently. Fucking snowflake-ass pussies with their fucking dick on their shoulders is what they are. Yeah. Oh, you barely brushed into me. That's, That's antagonization. I instead I antagonized the guy and I'm like, the fuck I did. So I stabbed him. <laughs> I said, take that for antagonization, you bitch. Now you stabbed. That's why when you asked me if I was having fun, I'm like, yeah. I didn't do nothing wrong. I was walking. What the hell did I do? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Nothing. A black man walked around is not a crime. That's a regular gay. <laughs> Well, the poker works, and that's fucking great. And the other one scuttled but, off. <clears throat> but the uh, missions are not working well. No, no, they are bloody fucking not. I mean, they're working well if you want to get nothing but level, I guess. I mean, if we wanted to, we could sit there all day just getting level, doing the same shit all day. Oh, no, 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 I'm, I'm not in for grind like that. But if anything, that would just get really fucking boring. It got boring in the fucking hour that we were stuck in it. Yeah, it did. I mean, we were playing poker for a good two hours, though. Almost, just about. Maybe, I don't know, I don't keep track anymore. We're having fun with poker, though. Good thing it works. Because when stuff doesn't work, it makes you wonder, why the fuck did you put it in the game? Well, there goes all the alligators that may or may not be near. <sighs> Is it because I was shooting? Yeah. I was killing me some turkeys. Like I said, I will say that it is actually a good way to get a level up, and if anything, I might use it just to get leveled up. At some point, I might just do it by myself and get leveled up. Because uh, I don't really care about getting bored. I'll just get over it. I just want to get levels. Because unfortunately, levels are a thing in this game. And if you're not a high enough level, then you're not going to be able to get something unless you want to buy it with gold. Which is another thing they need to fix. There shouldn't be a level cap on shit. No, there shouldn't. <laughs> If you've got enough money, you should be able to just buy it. There shouldn't be a level fucking cap. 
The only reason that level cap and gold is in the game is because of money. I'm aware. Microsoft, stop being a greedy bitch. Stop paying people like Bobby Kotick who only give a fuck about money and don't care about everyone having fun. And I'm just like running around now. I will say, man, I love the sounds in this game. All the sounds are just spot on. I'm just going around killing random animals. I do not want to go after an alligator snapping turtle. I want to go after a full-blown fucking alligator. <laughs> Fuck it, it's right here. It might despawn if I even wander away barely at all. <laughs> You want to know a couple? All you had to do was go over. What the hell are you doing? Just fucking around, actually. Just fucking around. Well, I mean, I'm just saying, it's not like they fucking attack you. They don't. Hell, half the time they don't even notice that you're around. Which, huh? They wanted to make. <laughs> Let me just point something out. The snapping turtles are highly aggressive. And if you're even like two centimeters away from them, they will come at you attacking. Two and centimeters is really fucking close, mate. Maybe not even that close. Maybe two feet away from them. They don't have the best eyesight. Oh boy, they've got a strong fucking beak. Yes, I said beak. Yeah, because they don't have teeth. Yep, it is a beak. A really strong beak. Almost like a fucking bird, funny enough. But it's a, it's a snap girl. There's a lot of birds that are exactly the same way. They're very territorial. Mm. Very territorial. If you went anywhere near him, he would try to attack you. Unless you're me. Me, I was the only person he ever liked. So. I just killed a whooping crane. What's so scared about your face? It was three star. Oh, I forgot. What the hell did you forget? <laughs> Fucking had my uh, bandana on. Wow. Snapping turtle carcass, the whole thing for 90 cents? And I didn't even skin it or gut it? Uh, are you fucking shitting me? Told you it wouldn't be much. You didn't want to listen. Done. Skinning it and gutting it is worth more than selling it whole. I should get $10 for that, not fucking 90 cents. 
You know what's cool is when you kill them with just your foot, they actually sound like a dinosaur. Because that's what they are. I like how it just keeps popping up resourceful. Mate, they've lowered the amount of money you get from turning in animals that you hunt. Did they? Yeah. Well, they made the animals a plenty. Not as far as I've seen. I've seen a lot of animals. A lot more than usual. Sometimes there will be none. What are you talking about? You haven't seen a lot. In this free roam, I haven't seen a lot. I'm saying, in, dude, I'm saying like before you could spawn into a free roam and there would literally be none. I wouldn't even be any fish. I'm saying now, at least there's fish and shit. Oh, I'm seeing a lot more, a lot of shit, dude. I've killed at least 30 fucking bullfrogs. Craft another. Okay, go on. There we go. Craft them all. <coughs> hey, mate. This may seem random, but you know, like a bunch of YouTubers who fucking plug like this video. If I get so many likes, I'll do blah blah blah. And then they have fucking uh, anim animations on screen saying, Don't forget to hit the like button. Yeah. Yeah, that pisses me off. Yeah, me too. Right, I was going to watch this one video. This dude was actually going to talk about something I was interested in. And he kept hammering. Just, oh, press the like. Do the like. If so many likes, I'll do blah. I'm like, okay, I'm, I'm sick of watching your video. It's just a fucking... Horror fest of you bitching and moaning for likes. I don't fucking care. I have told people dislike this video. I don't care. Fuck it. Dislike this video now. Man, oh, there's yeah. a lot. Speaking of, of YouTube's and views and whatnot. Uh, yeah, you go ahead first. I'll, I'll wait. I was just saying there's a hell of a lot of gators where I am. I'm making my way yeah. over there. Yeah, yeah, speaking of likes and everything, the you, the Google ads was throttling the amount of average daily views I could get so that they could make more money off of it. It's a fucking scam. Literally. I got two perfect skins, by the way. Nice. See if I can grab one both. of them. Yeah, my horse can't carry both of them, unfortunately. Then your horse can't carry the other. It's a long fucking walk. You know, we're right back to square one, you know? Hunting and, and skinning gators to get money in this game. 
because the mission is fucking broke. Where's that red dot? Some sort of wild fucking animal. Where is it? Who's gold? Dude, what the hell is fool's gold? Pyrite. That's the uh, other name for it. It basically it just looks shiny. No, dude. It's a thing. It says it's a thingy. Someone invited me to it. Oh. Fish caught with live... Wait, what? You can use live bait? Come on. I found a gator. Uh, there's a bunch of them over here. Possums. <clears throat> Get a few of my challenges complete. There we go. Dead eye plus fifty percent. Wait, what? Probably one did. Hmm. I just found a catfish that was kind of laying on the ground. Let's just pick it up and. Pick it up and put it in my pocket, apparently. Yeah, we're back to square one, but at least we could play poker for fun if we wanted to. Oh yeah, yeah we can. I think that's a good thing. Because poker is supposed to be fun. Yeah, we had more fun doing that than the fucking mission. I just try to make you a little bit of money, man. And it wouldn't... I got three fucking alligator skins that are three star. Are you kidding me? God damn. I already got one, so I'm gonna go and sell it and come back. <coughs> hey, Slim's in the three. chat saying hello. Hi, nice. what's up, Slim? Thanks, Slim. Uh, I would love even. some pizza right about now. Who? Hash browns. Funny, his name is uh, has food in it, and I'm fucking hungry. <laughs> tacos, yeah, I would love some fucking tacos and some chimichangas. Pizza, tacos, chimichangas. Fuck, I want to eat everything. Um, I'm not gonna stand here for very much longer, dude. No worries, There's... just move on. No worries. Maybe go get more shit, man. I already loaded up as much as I can get without, you know, walking at the pace of a fucking snail. Yeah, I know it's unconventional, but at least it's one way of making a little bit more money since the fucking missions are not really helpful. Shit, mate. It looks like they're trying to force people into, like, buying the fucking currency. Is 
that's the only currency you can buy. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Looks like they want everyone to buy everything with fucking gold. I mean, you can earn money, yeah. But with it being that glitchy, oh my god, man. It's Holy fucking shit. Get off on that side of the horse. I wanted to get off on the other side. Been a lot of that lately, but they always move. Poor alligator skin, a dollar forty. And if you got a poor alligator skin, it's not gonna sell for shit. But all three star. It oh, sold dear, more. Dear. It sold for more than the entire snapping turtle carcass, which wasn't skinned and gutted. That's pathetic. Yeah, but you shot it too, so something to keep in mind. And they—if uh, you don't shoot it and you actually fucking and you get a three star or whatever. Damn, that, thanks, exactly. Slim. Lots of. Pointy, shiny bits there. That's Monkey money. says sup. I don't know. Are you misspelling soup? You forgot the O. Soap. Soup. Soap. 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 <laughs> forgot how to spell soup for a minute. Soup. I'm hungry. I want soup to eat. I'm taking these people's cheese. Fuck these people! It's my cheese now! I wanna eat that cheese! No, it's <laughs> mine! I'm also taking their cigarettes. That's right. Pizza, yes. Pizza! Mustache. Did you just say sausage? No. Mustache. It's from Cloudy with a chance of ball sack. I mean, meatballs. I think they put more inside of houses as well that you can get. There's that seems dudes. like a nice idea. My house. There's just a big old pot of beans being cooked. Oh god, you found your bean hut. It's not <laughs> pizza hut, it's bean hut. I never thought I never thought I'd see it again, my bean hut. Alright, here's my clothes, here's my dress. <laughs> Cause I would wear a dress. Okay, yeah, there's a gator over there, and he hasn't buggered off. Uh, oh, boy. Good. Okay, not on top of it, just next to it so I can skin it. Thank you very much. What are you doing? Uh, slap, slap him in the face. Slap the Go on, go on and do it. But with likes. Ah. Slap with likes. I don't care. Shush, you. I wish I'm going to slap. No. <clears throat> slap. No. If I say it, I'll slap him. No. You guys like this video right now. I will slap him in the face. <laughs> I got a good oh. alligator skin. A straight up, somehow, another fucking magic slap. Like, magic slap. No. Did you tell me no? No. Magic slap. No. Slap magic. 
It's super ineffective. And it missed. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it, Jim. I'm a doctor, not a magician, Jim. I'm a housemaid, not a magician. <laughs> Clean my house, bitch. I'm a housemaid, not a magician, Jim. Can you be both? No! Hey, I'm getting a lot of shit. It's getting real nice over here. I'm getting things. Ah! Why is it turning into a turkey? We already covered that, it's bullshit. Especially as slow it is, is as it is, whatever. It's real slow, that's what I'm getting at. Yeah. <clears throat> Speaking of slow rank ups and grindy bits, I was fucking around in Factorio a few days ago. And the, the infinitely scaling uh, researchables, those things get fucking ridiculously expensive. Upwards of millions at just level 21s. I mean, level 20. To, to research for like cannon shell range and damage. For the, the fucking auto cannons you get. That shit's ridiculously expensive. It shouldn't be that expensive if it's gonna scale infinitely. It shouldn't be that expensive at that low level, you know? Yeah, I understand, man. I don't really think anything should be all too expensive. In any game, for that matter. Especially this one. Also, if it's gonna scale and be that expensive and take literally, like, overnight and you go to sleep and come back in the morning and it's still working on it, if it's gonna take that damn long and be that expensive, research speed in that Let's game should be infinitely scalable as well. Well, that there should be an achievement tied behind it. Since there wants to, you know, since achievements have to be a thing. Achievements shouldn't be a thing. Thank you. Come again. They're useless and worthless. They, they shouldn't be, but they are, and that's what I'm saying. And since achievements are things, you know. <clears throat> it, was all, uh, it was back in the day, there was no such thing as achievements. Yeah, they introduced that with the Xbox 360. And the PlayStation 3, but okay. Yeah, achievements and fucking trophies are absolutely fucking useless. People think that trophies are something different. But it's still an achievement. You're trying to earn to get something. And most of the achievements are ridiculous. By yeah, ridiculous, they are. I mean, it's fucking ridiculous. Some are impossible. Quite literally. Some are literally put in the game so that they know who the fucking hackers are. Like that uh, Mile High Club achievement in uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare. That thing is literally impossible to get. Uh, and I yeah, even came is. within a few milliseconds of getting it. It is fucking impossible. Man, it's really fucked that they do that. That they put achievements that, you know, you're, you're tempted to want to get because it seems easy. Because it sounds easy. Like one of the achievements in one of the games I have is just shoot a couple people and you'll get an achievement. But whenever you attempt to do this achievement, it doesn't want to pop up. And it looks like that same group is on the train again. Yep. Lil Philip.
again. Press charges again. Charges are being pressed. I didn't again. even know you could. And press I'm gonna report him there. again because he's been a little fucking wank off soft cock whore. No joke. Back in this time, I wasn't even aware that there was such thing as that. Like um, the whole. You could do that situation or whatever, you know. I didn't even know that was a thing. That's what I'm saying. I don't know if you did. I did not. Fuck it. I'm just gonna report everyone in his fucking posse. They're literally riding the train, running around shooting everyone. Just because they fucking their... can. They're trying to get their challenges done. That's the challenge. What, to shoot other players on the train? Not necessarily players, but well, they animals. Shoot players. Yeah, well, not necessarily. You seriously need to start listening for a moment, dude. Stop being a little bitch for one second and just listen. So, not necessarily players, but unfortunately, it is an achieve or a challenge or whatever to kill anything that's living on a train. Yes, that's a fucking challenge. Well, that should exclude players. Because that's just bullshit. Yeah, it is, but people do it, so I mean, and the people that do it, he's going to probably be hunted down anyway and be killed, so it doesn't matter. Well, that's his second time of killing me and getting a fucking uh, charges pressed on his ass and reported. I'm gonna see if I got uh, what, caught fish with live bait. I gotta catch a fish with live bait. I'm trying to do my daily challenges. I'm not particularly bothered with even looking at mine. Only reason I'm trying to do them, dude, is to get them done. Saying that they give you gold every time you do one challenge. Oh, well, that's nice. So I kind of want to do them just so I can get more gold. I'm up to two bars of gold, so I mean. Wow. And, uh, what? Two bars. Already. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it has been a while. I've been literally doing all the challenges I can. <clears throat> all I have to do now is fish with live bait. That's a challenge. Uh, and the other challenges. I might need to look at all the challenges very quick. But so I'm down to I got two out of seven daily challenges done. So you can get seven daily challenges, and every challenge gets you twenty gold. After you get all the seven challenges done, you get sixty gold. So catch. Or fish caught with live bait. Uh, participate in top three or place top three in races. Player killed with a feeder in free roam events. Red Sage pick successfully uh, fended off a sabotage. Wow, dude. All of those seem ridiculous. 
the rest seem really ridiculous. The ones I like the fishing, it, it seems okay, but others just seem really ridiculous. Saying a sabotage only happens every three and a half like hours or so in the game. And it's a random fucking event that happens in random places, let me tell you, around the map. The amount of gator I found. That right there is a gator. Oh, I'm bad grills and this here. It's mad. That's just wild. <laughs> <laughs> Today, I'm in the top tip of Africa. Not really, but it feels like it. It's 133 degrees. There's a bunch of gators. You see them? I've got a gun. It's man versus wild. <laughs> I've killed this gator. Now I'm going to skin it and leave half the meat there. That's something I didn't never understand about this, right? You leave half the fucking meat there. Have you noticed that? When that uh, whole thing with the... Uh... When you skin the gator, you just leave it there? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The whole meat and all. Mm-hmm. Alright, a couple more. Let's see here. Wonder if I could start up a race now and just be me and you. That'd be nice. Uh, I'm don't think out, be mate. Nice. I'm petering out. What do you mean? Getting to the point where I want to stop playing because I'm I'm petering out. The game's not that boring, is it? No. I don't hear you getting petered out over Warframe. Uh, I haven't been playing that in a few days. Yeah, right. But I didn't hear you ever getting petered out about it. Eh. I'll probably keep playing that where it goes. A one pound, seven ounce bluegill. Okay, cool. I'm on my way over to where you are. You're at the butcher, right? No, I was uh, just standing here fishing. Oh, I thought you were at the butcher. I'm still on my way to you. I'm running. Right, okay. Um, I'm ending the stream recording. Eleven, uh, whatever you want to say. Uh, whatever I want to say.